Hey there, Paola of paolaponsenios.com, your source for soft gel nail education. Today we will be doing something super fun, turquoise nail art. I'll be using some of my favorite brands. Links are down in the description box below. Enjoy! <music> All right, let's begin with turquoise. I'm using Santa Fe Turquoise by Coco Es. I'm also going to be using the Nail Thoughts Firm Liner. I am going to be creating a swoosh pattern, a French tip on the index, and then a reverse French on the pinky nail. You can do one coat or two coats. It's totally your preference. After each, make sure you cure. My pointer and my pinky finger are done. I'm now going to move on to this Rocky Mountain Turquoise and I'm going to use this for the middle and the ring finger. And for the ring finger, I'm going to be creating something lovely. I'm literally going to try to recreate a turquoise piece. So I'm going to shape it into a little bit of an odd shape. It can be any shape you like to create a turquoise jewel. Like here are some other examples of something that I've already created. So have fun with this. And anytime you're stone marbling, it's a good idea to come back with the same color that you started and just overlap, darken, and line certain areas. Now I want to give this jewel some dimension, so I'm using a thick clear gel to do so. All right, and now we get jiggy with it. So we are going to be using studs and we're also going to be using an affix gel from Leaf Gel to go ahead and affix these jewels so that they indeed do stay. This is already a thicker viscosity gel, but it will help for you to be precise in your positioning of it so that it's not too bulky and it's not too thin and it easily holds your studs and jewels in place. It is time to finish this design. I'm going to be using a thicker viscosity top coat like glossy, followed by a thinner viscosity top coat, the leaf gel non-wipe top coat. Use whichever combination you like. Just make sure that you use something of thicker viscosity first before using your top coat. Otherwise it will wear off and your gems and studs will begin to be exposed and tarnish. And we are done. Here is the final result. 